Good afternoon, everybody, and I get to hopefully wish everybody had a very Merry Christmas. And now we are in between the two holidays, Christmas and New Year's. So hopefully everybody is getting set and ready for a great New Year's coming up in 2023. Every year I love to try to get a slogan going. So I want you to think, I can be all I can be in 2023. And that's the theme for next year, okay? So in the meantime, though, we are gonna introduce you to the next generation chiropractor, hopefully at Schoolies Mountain Chiropractic Center. This is my nephew, Michael Colbert. He is now in his finishing of seventh trimester, going into eighth trimester chiropractic school out at Logan in Missouri, home of St. Louis, the great brewery of Budweiser beer. But we're not here to talk about Budweiser. We're actually here to go and go over our next chiropractic adjustment video where we are going to be adjusting a chiropractic student and you might sit, sit there and think why does a chiropractic student need to be adjusted because they're in school and they should be getting adjusted all the time let me tell you when I was in chiropractic school we were the most maladjusted people on the planet why because we're learning our techniques and we're learning what to do and how to do it and why to do it and where to do it and when to do it and when not to do it so there are times where students are overly zealous and rambunctious with what they're doing and they they do too much or they do too little. So this is where Goldilocks is coming in now for Michael. He's learning how to be just right, not too hard, not too soft, get his techniques in alignment. And it sounds like from what he was telling me at lunchtime today when we had lunch together, he's learning AK, diversified, some extremity adjustments. Everything that we do here in the office, he's prepping at school so that next year when he graduates in December, he's gonna be a welcome member to our staff. He may get a better offer someplace else. Mom and dad, girlfriend may pull him away from school. Schoolies Mountain Chiropractic Center, but I'm going to try to convince him today and every chance I get that this is the place that he wants to call home. So without any further ado, Michael, say hello to everybody. Hi, everyone. Okay, so we're going to get Michael to lie down and we're going to give him a chiropractic adjustment, hopefully way better than he's getting at school. So without any further ado, Mike, lay down and we're going to get started. You're going to lay down on your back for me. So Michael's coming in. He's got a little bit of a right short leg going on. So we're going to start with the sacroiliac joint. And Michael's got a right SI joint that's a little bit out. He's got a left lower SI joint. A little bit of a right hip going on. Good. I'm not going to pick on my nephew for the digestion points that are out because we all miss eight over the holiday. But the stress points are there. I'm going to blame that on chiropractic school. Digestive points are a little bit out. We'll get those toned up for him because we've got to get him ready to have a wonderful new year. Good. Good. Okay, so let's get started with blocking Michael, get his pelvis aligned, and work on his hip. Some digestive points, a little kidney acupuncture point, stress points. Get him ready. He's going back to school on Monday. And he's got boards coming up in February, right, Mike? Mm -hmm. You think you're stressed now? Wait till you get through boards. <laughs> <laughs> so by now, everybody knows that we do a little bit of a smattering of techniques here in the office. We start off with an AK check using some SOT diversified blocks. We're gonna work some AK points for the ileocecal valve right now. This is digestion. This can be due to diet or stress. And trust me, a chiropractic student I all know too well can carry a lot of stress. And the reason why we pay attention to digestive points is because we want him to be able to digest and assimilate food, building blocks, help his body build and grow better. And we're coming into the Houston valve now. This is a large intestine point. So Mike, do I want to know what your diet's been like since no, you've been home? definitely not. <laughs> a lot of overeating yeah. and not wanting to get up and eating. I get it, I get it. Now you drinking enough water while you're home? Definitely not. Okay, we got to drink a little bit more water. Watch that diet, watch the stress. Out of spray. Oh, we try to avoid that with a passion, my friend. Too much refined sugar. That was good before coming home. It's always the coming home to get you, right? Yep. Time to relax. Yeah. 
Now you've got here 70% uh, of the way done with school. Mm -hmm. So this is a good thing. So now we've worked the ileocecal valve, the digestion points, the Houston valve, the kidney points. We're rubbing out the adrenal glands now to help him to try to de-stress and calm down a little bit. We're just gonna tap it off with a little bit of acupressure over the acupuncture points for stress here above the eyebrows. If you ever see anybody scratching over their eyebrows, rubbing, that's an inherent innate way of saying I need to de-stress. So you're trying to de-stress some of these acupressure points for stress above the eyebrows. Now when you go back to school, Mike, everybody who's rubbing above their eyebrows, you're going to say, you are so overstressed. Let me get you adjusted. Okay. And now hopefully we're going to give Michael a very nice diversified adjustment. And Mike, I need you just to totally relax for me. Pretend you're not thinking about school. There you go, that was nice. And let's go and get this one. There you go, beautiful. Now tell me, do they adjust you that well at school? No. <laughs> okay. <laughs> oh, Michael's upper traps are just a wee bit tight, right Mike? Yeah, just a little bit. Okay. Not painful at all or anything. No, not painful at all. You know I got this right spots. Mm -hmm. Now just so you know, your father paid me extra to get this done today so you would confess. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> there you go. Start to feel those relax. Mm -hmm. Okay, there we go. Okay. <clears throat> Now we're going to take the blocks away. We're going to recheck some things, make sure everything is nice and strong, and we'll start to get Mike adjusted. So we got the digestive points, the stress points. That's looking better. Cervical spine looking better. Excellent. Okay, so let's see what we got going on in the lower back with Michael. Yeah, a little spot, not bad. Big spot. Okay, Mike, do me a favor, land this side for me. <clears throat> there we go. And breathe in. There you go. Thank you. Face the other side. <clears throat> and again. And deep breath in. All the way up. There you go. That was beautiful. Turn on your stomach for me, Mike. Hey, position one looks really good. Position two does not look bad, Michael. Excellent. Okay, we're just gonna tilt you a little bit. There we go. Do me a favor, take a nice deep breath in. Breathe out. Breathe in. Breathe out. Breathe in. Breathe out. Breathe in and breathe out. Just a little respiratory technique to help open up the facet joints across the lower disc area from all the sitting somebody's doing, relaxing at home. Good. And then as I often explain, lower back tightens, neck tightens, we generally tighten somewhere in the middle. So Mike, you're gonna take a deep breath in, breathe all the way out for me. There you go, that was beautiful. Thank you, Michael. Now the last thing we're going to do with Michael is adjust his neck. He's got what's affectionately known as the tired bone that's a little saggy. A little bone that loves to make you tired, grumpy, grouchy, lethargic, irritable. I'm sure his sisters are appreciating that. And we'll give you a little traction to the neck with the flexion distraction table. And then he'll be ready for another trimester out at chiropractic school. And I'll get to fix him when he's home next. There we go. Okay, now Michael, you're gonna stretch for a moment. Let me just double check position one. Position two, all looks really good. Okay, so this is how we adjust a chiropractic student home on winter break from chiropractic school out at Logan home of Logan Basic Technique and Budweiser Beer. No, I'm only kidding on that one. But again, 
Schoolies Mountain Chiropractic Center, we love to think of ourselves as the leader of alternative health care. So if you saw how we adjusted a chiropractic student, remember the students in your life, whether they're college bound, high school, or grade school. Every student has postural stress, emotional stress, dietary stress going through school. So again, with a proper adjustment, adjusting not only the spine, but looking at those acupressure points that can in, uh, affect internal organs and glands, looking to see how those acupressure points tie in with the spine, we can get a very complete holistic chiropractic adjustment done from top to bottom in and out okay so that again we are getting the spine and the nervous system to react very well muscles joints organ glands and skin everything is working properly so that if you have a student in your life and you saw something that was of interest here please visit our website smcc4u.com visit the patient section get our email get our phone number give us a call we'd love to have a history and a consultation with you those are always at no charge and if yours is a chiropractic case that we think we can help we'll let you know from there we can set up a complete exam with uh, full orthopedic, chiropractic, neurologic, and physical exams, as well as any x-rays that we need to take. No problem, we do those here in-house. So Schoolies Mountain Chiropractic Center. If you do me a big favor, hit like and then subscribe. Pass it along to your friends and family. We'd love to grow our website channel so we can get more information out there. In the meantime, you guys have a great day. Hope you all had a very Merry Christmas and are looking forward to a wonderful, exciting, marvelous 2023 where you can be all that you can be in 2023. Schoolies Mountain Chiropractic Center. Dr. Jeff saying, have a great new year. We are your leader in alternative healthcare. Have a great day now.